I'm Alan Goodchild, Managing Director of Goodchild Marine Services, based in Great Yarmouth. I'm joined with Bob Baker, who's the um, master, oh, Harbour Master for the Port of London, and Ian Moncrief, who is a non-executive director the board, of the yeah. board of the PLA. And we have Didier Marchant, who is the designer of the Orc pilot boat that we're stood on. Today we've launched the first hybrid pilot boat for the UK. It's based on an Orc 136 hull and uh, we've, we're, we're proud to say that it's, um, it's, it's probably the world's first hybrid pilot boat. The boat has been built for the Port of London Authority to meet their uh, clean air strategies and it's going to work in Gravesend and in the Thames Estuary area, serving in the ships going up to London. It's being delivered after some extensive trials which we're currently engaged with. Um, being the first of type, we need to collect as much data as we can um, to sort of make sure we maximise the performance and also for future, for future builds where hybrids are going. The challenge of putting hybrid into a pilot boat is that the weight it carries. There's a weight burden attached with putting hybrid into anything and on a pilot boat that has to perform at speed, the weight is always a critical factor of any power boat because the more weight you put, the more uh, efficiencies you lose in terms of speed and performance. So the challenge was how do we squeeze hybrid and that additional weight into a boat that still has to perform a, a very serious role as a pilot boat. The project was started about a year ago at Seawork in earnest. That was when the um, contract was awarded. Um, so it's been about a year in build to this stage. Bearing in mind there's a lot of specialist equipment involved in building it which is custom built. There's nothing off the shelf for this type of product at the moment. So there's a, a groundbreaking really in terms of technology and equipment. 